let's listen in uh, to you know what happened on the moon uh, you know the lunar surface uh, i've got a little quotation here by the isro chief he says there is no problem in naming the area shiv shakti because well a lot of people started saying that you know why is the failed um, uh, landers uh, area called tiranga and uh, why are you uh, you know giving it a religious name, hint uh, 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 to the successful uh, you know um, uh, moon landing area called shiv, shiv shakti which i essentially personally in my limited opinion feel like there is no qualm or should be no qualm with that is that uh, the isro chief also feels the same which is nothing wrong in naming lunar land site shiv shakti meanwhile he also says that isro today has the best possible picture of the lunar surface so just be happy about that first be happy about the fact that you yourself in uh, the price of less than the budget of the interstellar in a price that is just twice the budget of an ss rajamouli film india put its lander on the moon in just 600 crore rupees and now we have the best images possible of uh, you know the lunar surface and we'll try and play out some of those uh, visuals as well requesting the control room to just uh, play out whatever visual that they have oh, that, that, that. That you have it's uh, now 12 meters ahead, ahead of the lander that's the pragyan rover I mean, it's uh, it's such a sight to behold. What a visual that we are in fact looking it's at. Turning it's turning around. It's turning around. Yeah, it's turning around. Remember, you you only made that uh, this thing. Though you were reading out saying that Pragyan will take a picture of the lander once it's uh, forward. Uh, it Absolutely. goes forward from the Vikram lander. That's what the ISRO chief said when mm -hmm. the prime minister visited the ISRO, uh, you know, ice track in Bengaluru, the telemetry and uh, command uh, sending center. I'm forgetting the full form of the acronym. Um, the day the prime minister visited that in Bengaluru, and it's commendable to speak that you know the prime minister. After a hefty BRICS summit and a trip to Greece, went directly to ISRO. That's where he was made to sit down in at the IST track and uh, in proper live television screens. The Prime Minister saw the ISRO chief also said that. Uh, uh, oh, well, it's it, uh, the data collection. The data, data collection, collection is, is also a little, started. little uh, difficult because it takes time for images to come. But, ladies and gentlemen, what you're seeing on your television screens is the latest moon probe it's the latest findings now if you can see on the um, on the chart on the bar graph that you can see it says uh, variation of temperature on the lunar surface yes, uh, will uh, increase in depth take a look at that how about uh, uh, the control room how about you pause it right there so, so that the viewers can actually see it see this is what uh, the uh, temperature says that uh, below Eight centimeters in the soil. It is supposed to be at around minus ten degrees. Right. Minus ten degrees at the depth of eight centimeters, and fifty-five degrees centigrade at topmost layer, little mm -hmm. above the mm -hmm. level of the ground. So this is interesting uh, thermal reading that is coming. So the basically, the deeper you go, the colder it gets, or the hotter it gets. Well, this says it is uh, colder. Colder, and the first observation gets. from the chase payload on uh, this thing, in fact, thermophysical mm, mm. experiment says that measure the temperature profile of lunar topsoil around the pole so to understand thermal behavior of the moon's surface. So it's a big, uh, you know, understanding of uh, what is actually happening just to understand as to whether, uh, you know, the question of how water could exist. What forms it could exist as well? Uh, Chandrayaan 3's Vikram lander module has recorded temperatures at various layers right. of the lunar surface, uh, and on Sunday, in first such experiments that is set to offer new insights into moon's thermal behavior and characteristics, lunar soil, especially close to its south mm. pole, the temperature mm. graphs released by the space agency on Sunday reveal that the temperature drops significantly as the probe dug deeper into the lunar surface. And it's really fascinating, isn't it? Yeah. And Which, uh, while not what unexpected, seeing? is the first time it has been quantified so minutely. You know, Vargas, what we're seeing, this movement of the rover, you know, I'm reading here, it says, it says that, uh, you know, turnaround time between each rover movement, um, movement operation is five hours. Oh my God, uh, okay. Moving the rover from point A to point B involves many steps. For every path planning, onboard navigation camera data must be down, must be downloaded to ground for, for generation of a digital elevation model. Then the ground and me mechanism teams will decide which path to take and uplink the command for the rover to follow. So, uh, take a look at those visuals of the rover moving around on the lunar surface. It basically takes five hours. Now, uh, what we're seeing is a slow turn that the rover will now conduct. It's going to go up ahead, then it will take a slow turn. And that turn, this point A to point B, essentially is a five hour long process. So, experimentation is not easy on the lunar surface. Uh, my dear friend and why am I saying lunar surface again and again I beg your pardon on and around Shiv Shakti 
Shiv Shakti point, yes. Uh, but uh, what a visual that is. And you know, this is the first time something is known about the South Pole and especially on the lunar right. soil. And it is uh, big enough because uh, you know, there have been a lot of people who had mocked at the, the prospects of India actually having a space program that mm. could reach the moon. It was and that's not and, and if that's not all, Vargis, the rover, the rover has already surmounted its first lunar obstacle as well. So there is a hundred millimeter deep crater that you can see that you can see on the right side over there. Yeah, it's a hundred mm crater. That that's a hundred mm crater which it has clearly crossed. Like you can it see was the nothing. tracks. You can see the tracks uh, on that crater. On that crater, it's a hundred millimeter. It's it's a really small crater, but uh, albeit it is a lunar crater. Um, at and around Shiv Shakti. Uh, so the rover has sent a temp profile. It has crossed a 100 millimeter crater. I am beaming with a smile from ear to ear. I don't know what's up happening with you, Vargis. Uh, but uh, first temperature profile, a big, big day. Big, big day for, uh, you know. Uh, you know, it's, it's so heartwarming to see that uh, rover there and uh, on the lunar surface, carrying on with its experiments as intended. And I'm just uh, very curious about the data. And this is the yeah, first data that I've People talk about conspiracy with. theories about Neil Armstrong's uh, moon landing that it never happened. It was a Hollywood <laughs> set. And uh, some um, a person in our uh, you know live chat also saying, can you tell us where and which studio this moon landing was filmed? Well, let me tell you, uh, buddy. Um, mm -hmm. I'm of course a huge uh, controversy theory um, you know addict. But this time around, you've got to believe it. The way with the which it has been carried out and the ISRO, I so wholeheartedly appreciate the Indian Space Research Organization for really taking it upon themselves See, to put uh, out the right kind of know, pictures. To put uh, out the right uh, kind but of pictures. Kabir, a lot of people tend to have that uh, thing that we never landed on the moon, right. or have the Americans landed on the moon. But yeah. I don't know about nobody landed on the moon. No, yeah, I don't know about the Americans though. So, um, uh, Ajay, but if, I if, can definitely if you tell find you out what studio this is. Do let us know as well. <laughs> no, if I really can uh, actually find out, yes, uh, you have actually said it that where it is done. Even I would love to know. But for me, I think they have landed on the moon.